One of the main things that you want to be concerned about when replacing a constant current driver is making sure that the new driver that you're installing has the same milliamp rating for the light fixture that the current driver is supplying. Majority of the time you'll have a label on it or you can tell by the part number whether um, th that will annotate what milliamp rating is needed. But if you don't see that and you're not sure, what you can do is measure the milliamp or current going from the driver to the fixture. And to do that, you need to measure it in circuit, meaning that you need to open the circuit and put the DMM, your meter, into the circuit. On your DMM, you need to make sure that you have moved the connectors over to the amp section and not the voltage section, and then select amps, and, um, and then you can hook it up. If you don't do that, you can damage your, your meter. Also, you want a relatively good meter that can measure to about three decimal points in the current level. So to, to insert the meter in the circuit, what you'll do is you'll open up the circuit and you'll take the positive, the red lead of the meter and connect it to the positive output of the driver. And then you'll take your negative lead going out of the DMM or your meter and hook it up to the positive going to the, uh, the fixture. And once you have that, you can see that the current will be flowing through the meter. And then when you turn on the meter, or turn on the fixture, you can see that the milliamp reading uh, is shown on the meter. And the meter is current reading uh, 0.915 amps or 915 milliamps. So now you know that the driver that you're going to be installing as a replacement needs to be set for 915 milliamps.